Are you purchasing Israeli dates? As you prepare for Ramadan, are you making sure that you and your family are consuming justly during this holy month? Well, we are here to help. American Muslims for Palestine is launching its annual Israeli date boycott campaign. Since 2012, American Muslims for Palestine has been leading a nationwide boycott of dates produced in Israeli settlements. As a result of diligent Palestinian organizing in the U.S., Israeli date imports have dropped dramatically over the years. According to recent data, the market share of U.S. imports of Israeli dates have dropped to 16.5% for the market year 2020-2021, compared to 25% in 2015. But why boycott Israeli dates? Did you know that approximately 60% of Israeli dates are grown in illegal settlements in the occupied West Bank? As of 2019, more than 200 Israeli settlements were established in the West Bank, housing over 600 settlers, all in contravention of international law. Furthermore, the Israeli date industry and settlements is highly exploitative. Because of the grueling work that date harvesting requires, Israeli settlers hire Palestinian laborers, often from the occupied territories, who are paid low wages. Worse, Israel prefers to employ and exploit Palestinian children, who will ultimately work for less. Our date boycott campaign is not only aimed at settlements in the West Bank, it targets Israel as a whole, an apartheid regime that exists throughout all of historic Palestine. When you boycott these dates, you're taking a stand against Israel's colonization of Palestinian land and its exploitation of Palestinian land and labor. This Ramadan, break your fast with justice. Join our 2022 Israeli date boycott campaign at ampalestine.org slash dateboycott and learn how you can participate in this international boycott movement for justice. It is time we hold Israel accountable, and we can't do it without you. Get involved today by following us on our social media at AM Palestine for all of our campaign updates.